Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are gonna learn about its contour convex. Uh, this tells us about the contour convexity. Is uh, it will give us a boolean type output. The, it will tell us the contour input given to this function is convex or not. Not convex means is concave. Let's remember the difference. Concave is the contour shape is forward to inward, and the convex is the uh, the shape out, outline shape is forward to uh, outward. This is the difference between these two type of uh, these two type of mathematical term. And let's pass to the code part. You will remember from the previous video. Until here, we already learned about the previous things. I'm gonna use this to put the text inside this center of mean enclosing circle. If you didn't know about this, you can check the previous video. And after that, let's directly calling the convexity convexity of contour in the boolean type and calling the function uh, which is is contour convex and we are basically giving the input as one of the contour in the for loop we are giving each contour as input to this function and we are gonna see at the output is is convex or not let's put text and see in the results the first of all give the image then the text is uh, is will be will be come out according to the convexity boolean type, and let's measure it with the turner operator. If it is convex, write to the text just uh, convex, and if it is not, put concave. Then the point we are gonna use the center of the enclosing circle center and after that just write the fonts and the color of the text and thickness okay let's see the results first of all i think it's done okay and this is our input and this is the output you can see that uh, maybe more thicker is better to write let's make three You can see the results for for example you will see all of the contour given to the right side this is the drought contours by the way and it's telling all of them as concave there is no convex but you will see that okay this is maybe concave this is maybe concave this is also already concave 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 but this is looks like convex right then what it, why it's telling us concave it the the secret is in the detail if you zoom not to this part maybe to this part you will see this contour is in this shape so the open cv understand the the backend understand this is looks like a concave not convex so that's why it's giving the boolean type as zero not one not convex that's the main reason and this is the most important part you need to be careful about this function is contour con contour convex function this is the most important part just be careful because the shape looks like concave convex but it's not con convex actually when you zoom you will understand it so what what type of contours it will tell convex let's make another example here i already copied before let's toggle out and let's see the results again here uh, what i did i here uh, made a simple rectangle you can see right this is totally convex and then it's telling us this is convex you will see here it's based on this one so that's how it's giving that part that part convex so you need to be careful very careful uh, how to eliminate this maybe you can use a road and delayed functions or you can use uh, some blur functions like median blur or gaussian blur to eliminate this this tic tacs and after that maybe you can get the shape as convex you need to be very careful about that function and uh, that's all for this function for this video see you in the next videos